Welcome to watching Self-Assembly Guide of Chasing Ping 360 Sonar Kit. This guide is an advanced tutorial. You are advised to perform relevant operations after mastering relevant knowledge. First, unscrew the connecting wire nut. Pull out the stop rope. Force the top cover apart. Remove the original two connecting wires from the circuit board. Screw out the connecting wire nut and pull the wires out. Then the original connecting wires are removed. Before installing the new connecting wire, check the O-ring at the nut first. Ensure it is well sealed. Put the new connecting wire through the sealing port. Tighten the connecting wire nut properly. Then install the power wire and communication wire to the power port and network port respectively. After connection, align the notches. Cover the sonar shell tightly. Then pass the stop rope through the hole. Finally, tighten the nut at the ceiling port to complete the connecting wire replacement of Ping 360 sonar. Put the sonar in the buoyancy module. Install 4M3 by 25 screws on the bottom of buoyancy module and tighten them. Connect the mounting support and install it on the ROV. Activate the accessory in the app and connect the computer to the remote controller's Wi-Fi. Open the Ping Viewer software. The software will automatically scan the device. Click the settings on the right. Select Static IP. Set the IP address to 192.168.1.107 and click Confirm. Select this item to enter the sonar interface. Finally, please test whether the sonar works properly. After replacement, if your sonar still cannot work properly, please install an adapter board. First, disassemble the sonar shell. Remove the connecting wires from the circuit board. Then remove the two screws of the board and install the copper pill. Connect the adapter board's power and network ports using the power wire and communication wire, respectively. Connect the power wire of the adapter board to the PL9 port of the sonar circuit board. Connect the communication wire to the Ethernet port. Place the adapter board and tighten the screw to fix it. After the adapter board is installed, Connect the sonar's connecting wires to the power port and network port of the adapter board, respectively. After all connections are made, make sure that all connecting wires are properly connected and installed. Cover the sonar shell tightly. Put in the stop rope. Tighten the connecting wire nut to complete the adapter board installation. If it still cannot work, Please check whether the wires are connected correctly again. If you cannot solve it, please contact the relevant after-sales staff for help.